Hey there, this is Cam Blam Boom 29 and welcome to an announcement video. Alright, so I know it has been a really, really long time since I've made a video. And there's a whole, and I mean a whole lot of reasons to it. Which is exactly what I'm about to explain in this video. So, um, I'm going to start with all the updates. Update number one. Um, I got a little surprise, and that surprise will be a new phone. So, the one this was one of the main reasons uh, I couldn't make any videos is because I had to get a new phone, and I got was the Samsung Galaxy S Edge. I mean S7 Edge, S Edge. <laughs> I don't know if it's focused or not. I'm sure it is. Anyways. Um, so yeah, um, the reason I had to get a new phone was because my old one, I don't know, one day when I was, uh, coming home from school, uh, I was on the bus when I turned on my phone, I mean, it came on, but the screen didn't. So basically the screen went out. So yeah, that kind of sucked. So then on that same night, I got a new phone and so I was pretty happy. Uh, but I kind of lost a few things and like i transferred all my stuff already but i kind of lost all my contacts i think i still have them i still have them in my old phone it's just i'm having trouble having to find the file with them in it with the contacts in it to where i can transfer it but i don't, I don't know i have been using my laptop which is kind of crap now but i think i haven't used it my uh my dad he put a new hard drive in it like it's like one extra gigabyte it's like a really old computer. I've had it for like five years now. But anyways, besides that, um, there are some other things that I lost, which I will explain. So, okay, update number two, um, furniture. <laughs> My house, as you can see behind me, I have a new bed set and it, oh my God, it is great. And so um, we're getting all kinds of furniture now and act like we still have a few things to do. I still got to, uh, finish my closet and some other things. So now um, there's some steps right there Where my brother can go up it because he's always wanted to get on the top and he can't climb on ladders because he's Handicapped so he he yeah, so he's got a little step. So and I sleep on the uh, bottom bunk Basically, yeah, so that's about it. Um, eventually I will try to do a, a tour on it you know, tour the house, you know, show all my furniture. But anyways, okay. Update number three. Uh, oh, right. Mario and Luigi plush series. So now that I'm getting all kinds of furniture, uh, I'm, I'm going to wait until I have all of my furniture, all of it, completely done. And then I'll start uh, making my Mario videos again. And I'm going to be so happy with it. And I've gotten a few new characters that I've been wanting to use badly just so much, but I just couldn't because of... Well, yeah, obviously I couldn't make any. Okay, so, uh, what's, oh yeah, update number four, my Minecraft videos. So, look, with me having a new phone and I've lost some stuff, well, one of the things I lost was my Minecraft world. Now, my Minecraft worlds were saved in the files or whatever, I think. I mean, I saw them in there as I was transferring, but when I tried transferring, it's like, my world just wouldn't come up every time I loaded up Minecraft. Unless I was doing something wrong, I'm not exactly sure. But, <coughs> sorry about that. Oop, didn't mean to hit the microphone. Oh, yeah, I'm trying out my new microphone with you. I don't know if you notice or not. <laughs> Anyways, besides that. So yeah, I think we have to start a whole new Minecraft world, which is kind of sad, but it's been a really long time since I played Minecraft. I, I don't even think I remember how to play. Because I've been playing Terraria so much on my DS, my 3DS, that it's like, I, I don't remember how to play Minecraft. So, <laughs> that'll be a nice new experience. And now, uh, let's see, update number five. Uh, what was, what, what was the next update? Shoot. How could I completely forgot? Uh... Oh. Um, okay, I don't think this is one of them, but I'm just gonna say it anyway. So it's my Super Mario World series. Um, 
I, I don't even know if I can do it anymore. I still have my Super Nintendo on my games, but I just don't know if I'll be able to plug it up into my TV and all that. I don't know if I can still make videos of those. But yeah, so there's that. Okay, so I think that's I think that's all the updates. If there's something else, then I just remember later on. I'll pr probably put it in the uh, description, so be sure to check that. Also, um, okay, there's there's one more thing. Uh, well, another reason why I haven't been making videos. And this is a big one okay so this is where all the emotions are going to come out as you've seen from the little tiny short like 32 second video that i told y'all i mean that i sent out posted whatever the word is and saying that there's going to be emotions because it, it was kind of heavy on me okay so it was at the beginning of the year kind of when we were just starting school back up and it was the like Usually, okay, when we go back to school, it's on a Thursday. So it was Thursday, then Friday, then the weekend, then school just completely starts back up. So first day of school, um, I have some friends, okay? I have uh, quite a few friends. And one of the friends I've been hanging out with, you know, for at least a year, um, well, he's, I don't know, something happened. Whenever I went to school and I went to him, I tried talking to him, like, he kind of just ignored me like like I, you know i as if i wasn't wanted there or something you know like when i was with him and the group that i was in they just it's like they wouldn't even acknowledge me so i was like okay whatever and then so then the next day the uh, same thing happened well actually no i'm sorry first day he wasn't there the second day is when he ignored me so yeah but and way before that, in like December, uh, me and, and my friends and him, uh, my friend, which I'll tell you his name in a little bit, uh, we had this group chat and we were going to do, he, he first con uh, messaged me saying, oh, we're going to try and do a, uh, like a little uh, chat video thing. I can't remember what it was called. What was it called? Uh, shoot. I don't know. I forgot. I forgot the word. I'm drawing a blank here. I'm I'm just thinking too much. But besides that, um, I'll probably put it in the description later. <laughs> Anyways, so, and then all of a sudden they wanted to, as we were about to start it, then they decided to kick me out. Well, one guy just told me uh, they don't think I should be in it because I wasn't prepared or something because I... On that same night when he messaged me i wanted to watch a movie with my mom and so i just wasn't a part of the group but then later i just looked back on the messages and you know try to catch up and you know figure out all right this so this is the game plan all right i got it but then all of a sudden this one guy tells me you know what you should just like I mean, these aren't his exact wor exact words but he wanted me to just kick me out of the group i mean well the chat is what i meant and so and then all right forget you guys and then i just kind of left and i left the conversation and then so yeah and i'm bringing this up because i thought it had something to do with why uh he was ignoring me and his name is trey trey i don't know his last name i can't i, I don't know his last name i've known him for at least a year or a year and a half now and i don't even know his last name god well it's not his real name but I'm not gonna say anything. Anyway, so then that weekend it was I went to my dad's house and so I I messaged him and I said you know I wanted to apologize what I said before because it was like weeks ago I was like th four weeks ago that uh, that conversation happened you know so and I should have apologized sooner but still I apologized and it was, I know I kind of freaked out about it. But then whenever he messaged me back, he just decided to say, all right, well, I think it's time I take, I, uh, take initiative here, you know, like, which is meaning, you know, take charge or something like that, you know. So then he starts going on, you know, I just think we really shouldn't hang out anymore. We shouldn't be friends, you know, 
you, you I just find you strange and immature, you know, things like that. And, and it was like, don't come around me, don't hang out around me anymore. And so then as I was reading it, I was shocked because I couldn't believe he would say that. I mean, we've been friends for at least a year and a half now and all of a sudden he wants to shut me down at the beginning of the year. And like, I don't even know what's going on. I didn't know if it was about that whole conversation thing and which I don't think it was, but I, I just didn't understand it because he all of a sudden he wanted to stop being friends with me. And it, and you know, guys, like this was the first time like I was actually really hurt because I've never felt something like this before. And so just like five minutes later, uh, I was okay. I remember I was already at my dad's house. And so five minutes later, I was laying in my bed. Well, my brother's bed, which is on the bot, which is also a bunk bed. I, I was laying on the bottom. And so my stepsister walks in and was like, hey, what's up? And I was like, nothing. And then I was acting, you know, really aggravated. And then she decided to talk to me. And so I was talking to her. And so basically I told her what went down and everything that I just told you guys. And then uh, there was one part in the message that he sent me. And he said, you have your own friends. Why don't you go hang out with them, you know? And so as I was talking to my stepsister, which her name is Cadence, um, all of a sudden, whenever I thought back on that message, I realized, I, I, I just broke out and I said to her, I, I don't have friends. I don't have any friends. Those were the only people that I would hang out around and it really hurt me. And so as I was saying it, I started to cry and cause it really started to hurt my feelings and so I was just sitting there crying the whole time and uh, cause I, I just, every time when I look back on all the people I hang out, they're not, I feel like they're not even my friends. I feel like they're just people I talk to, you know, acquaintances, which is what most people say. And it made me think, well, I'm just all by myself all the time. I'm, I feel like I'm so alone, you know, I don't have any friends, no one, want, I feel like I just, so it hurt me so bad. And as I was crying and I just, it hurt me and it hurt me so bad. I didn't even want to talk back to him. I didn't even want to respond. So just after I let out all my emotions, talking to her and telling her how I felt, I just, the, after the weekend was over, I, uh, when I went back to school, I, I didn't go around him. I, I kind of just ignored him like he ignored me. So, and then it just kind of went on from there. We just stopped hanging out. But here's the thing. By the way, I'm, I'm not crying here. I'm just rubbing my eyes. My eyes have been itching all day because of the freaking allergies. It's freaking weather. Anyways, here's the thing. I am yet still mad because I didn't, I did not say anything to him, which there's so many things I wanted to say to him. Cause you know what? I, okay. So I told him one time, uh, one day, a long time ago, I was talking to him one day and I told him, you know, sometime in my, when I was in my uh, junior high, junior high school, whatever, I used to have a friend in sixth grade. Yeah, in sixth grade named Xander. And he was, it was a little weird, you know, but like me and him, we both like Sonic a lot, you know, Sonic the Hedgehog. So we talked all the time. We were like basically best friends the whole time. And then one day I find, I find out that he's an atheist. You know, and then once I find out, then I start like freaking out. I'm like, oh my God, you're an atheist? I don't want to be friends with you anymore. That, no, you, we can't be friends. I don't know, I don't think so. And so then I just stopped hanging around with him, hanging out with someone else and just trying to stay as far as possible away from him. Not only that, he was really weird, but I mean, eventually he moved at, at the end of the year and I never seen him again. <coughs> Sorry. 
And so bringing that up, it basically what I did to uh, Xander was that I stopped being friends with him just because of who he was. And basically Trey, he did the same thing to me. He's basically saying he wanted to stop being friends with me just because I was strange and immature, you know? But guess what? Yeah, I am a little bit at times, but he is too. He's strange and immature. And apparently, you know, he thinks that he's not, but he is. And so basically he's just saying he doesn't want to be friends with him anymore just because of how I am, you know? And that, to me, that's not right. And whenever I told him that story and he said, oh, that's not right, Cameron, man, you shouldn't have done that. And you know what? I regretted that. I regretted that because that was a really dumb thing I did because I don't I don't like to judge people like that's how they are and you can't just do that I mean sure you can like judge them in your head I guess but don't be like going up to them and like hey I hate you because of how you are and how you act it's really annoying just stop it and you know what that's wrong why would you do that just go up to someone in the face and just tell them that just right off the bat that's so rude and disrespectful and yet I tell him the story and he he agrees with me, you know, that was wrong. But yet here he is, he's going and not being friends with me just because of who I am. And, you know, if you uh, didn't don't want to be friends with me uh, because of who I am, because I'm so strange and immature, just because, you know, I started to open up a little more to him because we've been friends for at least a year and a half now. I've known him for a long time. Since I've known him for so long, I, I start to get a little more open and, and, you know, tell him some things that I normally don't tell people. And so, and now it's like, he's just saying I'm strange and immature just because of the more things I've told him about me. And so, well, you know what? If I'm so strange and immature, then why have we been friends this whole time? Don't you think you would have stopped being friends with me, you know, since the beginning? Like, seriously, you could have just told me, hey, look, just don't talk to me at the beginning. To where, you know, at the point where we weren't even friends at all, we just talked. You could have just told me that. And then we're like, okay, uh, fine then. I mean, why didn't you just do it in the first place? It just, it just drives me insane that someone would just, be like that you know and like okay i can understand you don't want to be friends anymore i get it but you don't need to say the mean things you know i know i mean okay look have you ever seen me hang out with other friends trey hmm? so that's when it really hurt me because i normally hang out with them all the time I mean, I do have other friends, but it's just I don't hang out with them a lot. So it's like whenever I, if I was to go back to them, it's like kind of awkward. <sighs> Anyways, so yeah, that really hurt me and I just needed to get it off my chest and I'm just happy I can, you know, happy I can tell you guys this. <sighs> I'm really surprised I didn't cry because it really hurt my feelings. But but you know what? I'm I'm done. I'm over it. I'm over it. Because you know what? If someone hurts you, don't let it affect you. Don't let it affect you. Just deal, just get over it. Cause yeah, it may hurt at first, but after a while you'll realize the things that, whatever the, the wrong things that this person has done to you or, or whatever it is, whatever the problem is, then you just say, well, you know what? I'm over it and I'm done. I'm done. And you know what? You're wrong and I'm right. You may not realize it, but that's okay. That's how you are and I, I can I understand that. But I'm just stating the fact that you were wrong and I was right. And you can disagree with me with all you want, but that's that's my opinion. And that's the thing. People don't understand the definition of an opinion. An opinion is something like, or a statement that someone says of what is on their mind. Basically, you know, they're speaking out their feelings or how they feel about something. That's their opinion. It's not a fact. It's an opinion. So you can't just go and try and change their opinion because that's their opinion. That's how they feel. And you can't go and change it. Sure, you can try, but it won't work. So for people out there, and if you want to say something to me, go ahead, do it. I don't care. It's not going to affect me anymore because I'm done. I'm over it i'm over all the 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 
disrespect and all that crap. I'm done with it. Yeah. So, anyways, besides everything I just said, um, there's a, another thing. Um, so, look. Like, like, okay, all this is honesty, okay? I'm telling the truth. This is not all just made up stuff. And you know what, by the way? There's a, a Trey, okay, Trey, he has his own channel and, it, and it's called Trey Shy Guy. And you know what, okay, I'm not saying, you know, go and unsubscribe to him because I'm telling you all this stuff. I'm just saying, you know, this is what happened and this is how it went. And you know, um, uh, uh, yeah, about, anyways, about YouTube channels. So my YouTube channel, well, one of the thing is, I don't know if you guys have ever wondered of why my icon is a mushroom, okay? And why everything is always about Mario or why I even started the Mario series. Well, it's pretty simple. So I chose that mushroom as my icon because I want my channel to grow. As all uh, beginners of YouTube channels or YouTubers, whatever, you have a sort of a, a cringiness, you know, like a little bit of cringe to where people won't even want to watch it. It's like, uh, 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 oh my God, I don't like this person. I'm just going to stop watching it. But those that makes sense because it's your first time making videos, you know. It's like you don't have a whole lot of experience unless you literally practice and practice over and over again before you actually posted a video, <laughs> which is probably what most people do, but, well, or some people, but most people would you know, start, start out, you know, straight, like, like, unskilled, you know, or they just don't know anything, so they just go ahead and do it, they wing it, you know, so that's kind of what I did, so I started with my Mario videos, and, because, I, I mean, I was basically inspired by Super Mario Logan, that's why I wanted to make Mario videos, because it was really funny, but, Mine is about mostly about adventure and action because that's what I want in my series to where people can, you know, get a little action, I guess, from my channel. A little bit. Sure, the effects may be a little cheesy, but I mean, you know, action. <laughs> so anyways, um, I chose that mushroom because I want my channel to grow. Meaning, you know, the more videos I make, the more I will improve because the more I understand on how to make these videos and the more, you know, thing like how more involved I want to get into my YouTube channel, you know, I want to try and make more videos. I want to try and get better uh, editing and better effects, you know, things like that, you know, like this microphone, like this microphone right here. I got this microphone to where I can have better audio for my videos. And so that's what I'm doing. And actually on my old phone, this wouldn't even work. But now it works on this new phone, so I'm quite happy with that. And with the and yeah, the new phone too, better camera, like better, uh, like quality. It looks great, and so that that's what makes me really happy. That's why I chose the mushroom, cause I want to improve my channel. And as I make more of these videos, I'm starting to get better and better, and to where it'll be less cringe. You know, to people won't be like, well, this is something I'm not gonna watch anymore. Bye bye. <laughs> That's the thing. That's what I want to do. And it just surprises me so much. You know, I haven't made a video in like a month. In a month. Okay. But yet I still have these 20 subscribers. And it's like, wow. These people really stay subscribed to my channel. And I don't even make these videos like every day. How, how does that even work? Do you really like my channel? Like... It's such, it just surprises me, but it makes me happy because y'all are still subscribed. And yet, you know, it's only 20 subscribers, but that doesn't matter because y'all are subscribed and y'all are watching my videos. Well, I know some of you are and some of you aren't, but I don't even care because y'all are subscribed. And that makes me happy because that means I'm growing. My channel is going up there. I mean, one day I could be one of the greats. I mean, not saying that will happen but that's that's the thing 
And that's what I just love about making these videos so much to where I can grow, not, not only improve my views, but also improve myself. You know, being able to understand more things about, you know, our friendship or, you know, understanding like how to communicate with people, you know, y'all in the com like posting in the comments, I can communicate with y'all and, and then maybe understand a little bit more. See, that's what I love so much about the mushroom. Cause it's, it's not just a mushroom, it's a symbol, a symbol showing me growing and that's what I like about it so much anyways just to end this video I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all a whole bunch uh, a whole section uh, of multiple clips of everything I've been through so far and then after that that'll be it so I'm gonna go ahead and show, uh, sorry. I'm gonna go ahead and say my final words and I'll show you all the video. And then that'll be it. And I hope you guys have, I'm so glad you guys have enjoyed my channel and thank you for, thank you for those 20 subscribers. I know it's not a lot, but it means, it means a lot to me. Thank you so much. And just thank you for staying with me and listening to me and it means a lot. Thank you guys so much. And I'll see you guys all later in the next video. Bye.